guys can tell from the title, today I'll be sharing with you guys how my day is like during my work day. So every morning, I'll wake up around 7am. Well, if I don't snooze my alarm, of course. I will wash up, heat up the food that I've made the previous night, and also make a cup of coffee, which I'll bring both of these to work. And I'm doing this so that I can save money, but also because I really enjoy cooking. Though, I must say that I'm not really good at it, but I'm trying, trying to get better. Slowly but surely. <laughs> skincare which consists of toner, moisturizer and sunblock and I'll be putting on minimal makeup and because in Singapore currently we all have to wear our masks at all times except when we are eating of course so I don't really put any concealer or heavy makeup because it caused me breakouts even just by wearing the mask so here I'm just putting on some mascara which I am obviously struggling. <laughs> and some powder. I'm using the Innisfree No Sebum Powder. Because my face gets really oily throughout the day, this really helps the oil from oozing out of my face. Some lip balm to keep my lips moisturized throughout the day. And also, a little colour on my lips which no one can see but it just makes me feel happy to have a little colour on my face Over here, I have some snacks to keep me going throughout the day. Maybe a little too much, I guess. And I also have some notebook, which I'll be doing some studying when there is no work to do. Outfit of the day, I'm wearing a long sleeve kappa top with my dark blue white leg jeans from Editor's Market. Also a super gal white sneaker. Uh, you guys must be wondering, what do I do at work, right? During the time I filmed this video, the system in my workplace was constantly down and we had almost nothing to do. Since my supervisor was really nice, he allowed us to bring our own things to do while waiting for their new instructions and tasks, which is why I brought my studying materials to study for uni. Thank you. 
Take me to the honeymoon Tell me you'll be on the soon I don't wanna wait no more We could be dancing in the stars We could be floating all the way As long as I'm safely in your arms And it don't really matter I'm really sorry but the audio during this whole footage was really bad so I'm doing a voiceover. I hope you guys don't mind. But over here I was just rambling about how I feel a little awkward holding my phone trying to vlog and was afraid that people are judging me. But I also contradicted myself by saying that there was nobody around the area. <laughs> but the view though, isn't it so pretty? Oh yes, and I was obviously enjoying vitamin D as well because the office was really cold. Feels good to be warm again. But how come the stars don't shine when it's day? How come the sky at night makes me this way? Why are you so far away? Galaxy cast away. So other than preparing for uni, I'm also learning Korean. I learned it from Korea, and the course that I'm learning is Learn to Speak Korean One. It is free, and I really like it. So you guys should really try it out if you guys want to learn Korean. haul for you guys. I got mushroom, yellow bell peppers, fish cake which I want to put in my topoki and I've been trying to find this for the longest time. Pickled radish to make some kimbap and ice cream. This is my all-time favorite flavor in almond pecan passion. And I also got some chocolate because Choco Spot was having up to 70% sales. So why not right guys? I really love chocolate. Especially dark chocolate. Yay! So that's all for my grocery haul. So just rest a bit and took a nap. A pretty long nap I guess. And then I woke up to do a workout. I'm currently doing this Chloe thing. What do I eat this abs challenge? And I'm at day 9. But I'm not sure if I'll continue. Because I tend to get kind of bored easily. So yeah. That's about it. 
So I don't want to bore you guys with all my rambling. I just want to say that to everyone who is watching this, I hope that things are slowly getting better for you guys, be it mentally, physically, or spiritually. And on days that you don't really feel good, always remember that it's okay to not be okay. And I hope that you guys can stay strong. And I hope that things around you will really improve as time goes.